I think we can all agree things are getting quite tough, aren't they? Everything's going up. Rent, mortgage, fuel, gas and electricity, food. A lot of us are having to tighten our belts these days. And when you do, you have to look at solutions to try and make things a little bit easier for yourself. Well, London is probably a place that's more pricey than most. I've seen some of the rents in there. I mean, I saw a, a flat one time for, I think, two and a half grand a month. I thought, who in their right mind could possibly afford that? And what do you get for it? It's nuts. Well, <laughs> I've seen a guy who's come up with a very, very novel solution to the problem. I'll tell you what it is next. <laughs> Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. Hope you're doing all right. This is the last video of the day, barring any incidents or anything that needs reporting. This is it. Well, let me introduce you to this guy, Harrison Marshall. Now, he's come up with a very uh, novel concept of beating the cost of living crisis. He's converted a skip into a little, uh, I suppose you could call it a flat, a little mini bungalow. I mean, check this picture out and... Uh, you tell me how you define this. It, it's actually set up in uh, South East London. And it's literally an eight yard skip with a timber frame and a barrel roof. And it's, you know, converted for use as a home. He doesn't plan on, uh, you know, being in it full time. He wants to live in it for a year. And the whole idea is he wants to encourage a conversation about the cost of living crisis. I mean, He's certainly doing that. I'm talking about you now, and I'm sure others would as well. I mean, the figures are, are mad, you know. Uh, the skip had been provided for £50 a month. So I suppose that's ground rent, isn't it? And uh, to actually convert it into a home costs four grand. Uh, he can uh, do pretty much most stuff in there. The only things he can't do is go to the loo. He has to use a, a portable toilet, which he has access to. And he has to shower at work or at the gym. But apart from that, it's got all the stuff. The only thing that it does need is uh, facilities wired up to it, which he's hoping uh, will happen very soon. So then he can use a cooker and microwave and whatever else so he can eat. He doesn't want uh, people copying this, you know, in any way, shape or form. Because I think he realises it is crazy. But it's to encourage... Uh, a conversation the the actual skip house is part of something called the skip gallery and it's a public art initiative intended to create space and opportunity for emerging artists that's the that's the definition but you know how could you live in a skip i'll be interested to see if he does uh last the year uh, or if anything else happens but it looks like he's done a tidy job inside and uh, we'll have to keep an eye and see how it goes. Let me know what you think in the comments below. And uh, I'll see you tomorrow. Take care, guys. And uh, see you then. Toodaloo.